my god my god this is so terrible cried mother claire how can you allow this jesus please come please how very terrible up to twenty thousand haitians overtook a small town killing their pets cats and dogs oh jesus jesus it's only the beginning only a chip off the iceberg of hatred and chaos planned for this nation lord i am heartsick so heartsick please have mercy on the people and their animals this is only the beginning of chaos so much more is planned you are safe here but my heart aches for those who are undergoing these terrible things the animals lord please have compassion for the animals to die is to gain for them now compared to what is coming jesus continued addressing me and all those who have lost a child and may have felt robbed of the joy of raising that child when someone you love is called home before you are ready to let them go from this earth it is a great mercy from us they will not experience the planned devastation that is yet to come think about it elizabeth your son would be in his early 20s and a prime candidate for the draft yes lord i understand that now and thank you for confirming that i'll be able to raise him in heaven my people you all need to continue to plow with whatever time you have left knowing that some day you will be reunited with your loved ones who have a relationship with me and your beloved pets for all eternity heaven is your ultimate reward not on this planet and you cannot begin to comprehend all that awaits you here we will forever be united in a way that may be difficult for you to imagine you will be reunited with children parents siblings friends who have given their lives to me if you have lost a loved one very close to you know that they are your future satan would like nothing better than to keep you stuck in the past and focused on sadness and resentment set your grief free by looking forward to what is to come and do not keep them in your past where the enemy will flood you with hurt pain and bitterness give me your sorrows and if you are willing allow me to take you by the hand and guide you to heaven to see how glorious and joyful their eternal surroundings truly are this will change your perspective and the mental captivity of living in the past will be broken and set you free from the heartache you will start to live in the present by taking up the reins and continuing to plow for my kingdom you need to trust me my loves if your innocent child or saved spouse is taken home early know that we have our reasons for allowing it ask for my help to understand and picture them in the most perfect place you can imagine your lives are but a vapor on this earth but the life to come will be forever and that was the end of his message we read in psalm 73:26 my flesh and my heart may fail but god is the strength of my heart and my portion forever amen